the tropical rainstorm that dumped more than a foot of rain across parts of South Florida also washed up more brown seaweed known as sargassum. A lot of animals uh, live by sargassum, like uh, fish, uh, crab, uh, shrimp. You know. Naturally, sargassum is a good habitat for those animals. Researchers say sargassum was only found in parts of the Gulf of Mexico and the Sargasso Sea until a tipping point in 2011 when it exploded. Barbados declared a national emergency in 2018. Truckloads of the seaweed have been hauled off of Mexico's Caribbean coastline this April. Uh, this year started early in the Gulf of Mexico, one or two months earlier than usual. Dr. Choi Min Hu is a professor of optical oceanography at the University of South Florida in Tampa Bay. He has freezers full of sargasm from different regions to study and says some beaches in America could see more sargasm wash up this summer than ever before. It could be even worse. Actually, in the past two months, April and May 2022, uh, those two months already set a new record. Researchers are now trying to figure out what drives sargassum growth and what might slow it down before it reaches America's coastlines. Between March and April this year, sargassum total amount simply doubled. It never happened in history. But what's the reason? You know, in the vast ocean. Temperature, wind, sunlight, storms, and the loop current in the Gulf of Mexico all play a role. Who says links to climate change and warmer oceans are still being reviewed? There are experiments showing once temperature is above a certain degree, sargassum growth actually slows down. Unlike red tide, sargassum is not toxic to humans in the water. Once it washes up and bakes in the sun, it can be harmful to humans and aquatic life, including nesting turtles. It's very bad. You don't want to be there. And it's more than the smell because rotten sargassum would attract bacteria. General outlook is pretty bad you know, for a lot of uh, coastal residents. For AccuWeather, I'm Bill Waddell. Hey, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, check out these other videos here and be sure to subscribe for new content and the latest weather news from AccuWeather.